Good day everyone, welcome to my channel In the initial video guys, we will create a program or machine problem that is being sent to us by one of our subscribers Before we start, I would like to say thank you so much to all my viewers, supporters, subscribers in my channel Especially Mars Malo, Ma'am Robilin, Sir Ernel, and Daven who are always watching my videos if you are new with my channel and then you like this video please hit the like button don't forget to share and please support my channel guys by clicking the subscribe button so let's get started i will call this program full-time part-time employees payroll system using java that uses polyformism inheritance in object-oriented programming approach in java programming language so let us uh, read no? at the end of the activity the student should be able to create a program that exhibit inheritance in polyformism when we say inheritance in java it will inherit the characteristic of our program to our new program in the polyform polyformism means uh, many ways no or more ways the advantage of using object-oriented approach in Java programming or other programming language is that code readability and code reuse that it will save a big amount of time in software development. So when I try to find the solution of this problem over the internet, there are some problems but the solution does not have. Uh, I would like also to thank very much from the bottom of my heart my friend Tom you know, who helped me out. You know, who helped me solve this problem Tom is a good friend of mine close up friend of mine that is also a software engineer so we have here thank you Tom for helping me out as always you such a big help you know, in my channel and also in my learning so software requirements latest version of NetBeans EDE Java Development Kit GDK 8 so procedure create for Java classes, name, run employee, employee, full-time employee, part-time. The run employee class shall be contain the following method that will able to use to execute the program. Number two, write a simple pro a program, a payroll program that will display employee's information. Refer to the UML class diagram for the names of the variable and method. This should be uh, the sequence of the program upon execution. Letter A, ask the user to input the name of the uh, employee. Step number B, prompt the user to select between full-time and part-time by pressing either F for full-time or P for part-time. Letter C or step C, if F is pressed, ask the user to type his monthly salary. salary then the then display the name and monthly salary if p is pressed ask the user to type his rate pay per hour and the number of hours he work for the entire month separate by a space then display the name and wage also we have here the uml illustration Note, you can add variables and method if needed. Just make sure that all the variables and methods in the diagram are properly used. Okay, so let us go to BlueJ. No? So we will go first no, to the part, uh, employee. No? So we have here employee, class employee, begin class string name. We create here the method. No? Uh, inheritance no? public void set name string this name public string get name no? getters and setters no? return name close that is for the uh, uh, employee no? for part time employee here so we have a series of variables par, uh, private double rate per hour private in our work private double wage then set wage wage multiply hours work multiply by rate per hour public double get wage set wage return wage public void set rate per hour double rate rate per hour rate uh, public void uh, set hours work in hours hours work hours equals hours no? this one for the full time for the part time employee 
the same thing however by this time it will only accept the monthly no uh, no the, the the rate per hour here the rate per hour multiplied by work hours get wage the same thing and then it will display the salary of the employee here let us close and then when we run our program so it is a very long process no it will ask no, uh, the user's name here press f for full time part time so conversion here fe full time employee will call no this uh, uh class 5 full time employee we create an object here if and then display no get name monthly salary and then display the name and the age no? for part time it will ask for rate per hour and hours for no separate pay space no? again we will call the class part time employee and M no? and then display and then else invalid option try again and a program will close don't worry guys because I will put a link in the video description where you can download the complete pro source code for free right click void main to execute okay Enter name. Let's say Jake R. Pomperada. Full time, part time, F. Basic salary 12,512. So it will display Jake R. Pomperada. Wage 12,512 and a program. Another example. With this time. Uh, name of my son, oh, Jacob Samuel F. Pomparada. Uh, letter P for part time. Rate per hour, number of hours for separate space. The see rate per hour is 43.23. No? Uh, hours for 40. So, name Jacob F. Pomparada. The wage of Jacob Samuel F. Compared is 13,729.28 and a program. Okay, so this is the end of our tutorial video on part time, full time, full time, part time employees uh, payroll system using Java version 1. I hope that you have learned something new in this tutorial video. Thank you so much guys for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and please support my channel guys by clicking the subscribe button. See you in the next video tutorial guys. This is my friend Jake saying bye bye for now.